Should you put your gold and silver in capsules? Well, the quick answer is, it's up to you. In this video, I wanted to share my opinions on when to definitely use capsules and when to save your money. Towards the end of this video, I also wanted to briefly touch on the different sizes for different pieces. So when should you definitely put your coins in capsules? It would be my recommendation to pay a little extra for the protection capsules provide if your coins or rounds are rare, expensive, in excellent condition, were purchased for resale, or are very old. These are some examples of coins and rounds that I store in capsules. The dual ounce Fenrir coin is the latest addition to the collection, and chances are very good that this thing will never be taken out of its capsule. Thanks to the capsule, I expect this silver piece to retain its shine and excellent condition for a long time. Check this out. I have an interesting and frankly unexpected experiment that I have been monitoring for a while now. Take a look at these two 2 ounce werewolf coins from the Canadian Mint. These were both added to the stack at the same time. Can you tell which has been sitting on my desk and which one has been in a capsule? Not only is this coin exposed to the open air, I handle it often. I have had these coins both for about 5 months now, and this one has a noticeably different tone than the other. It will be interesting to keep an eye on these to see the changes over time. This is an excellent example of what may happen to your silver if it is left outside of a capsule. So when do I suggest skipping capsules? It is pretty much agreed on by all stackers that putting your dollars towards the next ounce is a better use of money than encapsulating your generic rounds or coins. When it comes to one ounce generic rounds, these white tubes really are the perfect solution for me. It makes it so easy to store them and keep a count of them. As long as they are in relatively nice condition, I'm not too worried about small scratches or dings. At the end of the day, when it comes to generic rounds, an ounce is an ounce. I will say, for me personally, I do stick a lot of silver in capsules that would be more or less okay without them. For example, I have these silver eagles that spend the majority of their time in capsules, in tubes. Also, these generic 10 ounce bars would be perfectly fine stored without their capsules. However, I am more than happy to spend a little bit more money to keep my metals in the best condition possible. Another thing to keep in mind is the fact that I am constantly moving my gold and silver around to make videos. So any kind of extra protection is a positive thing. Capsules and tubes are inexpensive, but they're not free. So it's up to you to weigh the benefit of encapsulating your metals. Another thing that I would like to mention are these tubes for 90% silver. The brand of these tubes are Edgar Marcus. They are very high quality and even come with a screw on top. Putting my constitutional silver in these is a great way to stay organized, and it makes counting them quick and simple. I highly recommend them unless you have a huge amount of 90% silver. Then it might be best to find a different solution. At the end of the day, the individual pieces of my stack are organized and stored in containers, whether that is capsules or tubes. Then those are stored in cases, which are tucked away in my safes. Organization, in my opinion, should be a high priority. After all, we spend a considerable amount of time and money on our stacks. Now with all of that in mind, I wanted to briefly chat about capsule sizes. It is worth mentioning that not all capsules will fit all coins and rounds. It will be worth your while to take time and make sure that the capsules that you purchase will actually fit your precious metals. Something that I do is to go ahead and check the reviews of people that have already purchased the capsules. Nine times out of ten, they will tell you if it fits your coin or not. If you're interested in any of the products that you saw in this video, I made the shopping experience quick and easy by putting Amazon affiliate links in the description below. On your way down there guys, make sure you freeze that like button. And if you're not done watching cool gold and silver content, check this video out next.